you, Caroline. Might be more than you think. Don't sweat it. I've been inclined. Sub zero. Chapter three. Sub zero. Sub zero. Que passa? The four defenses stand down as you command, Grandmaster. It is confirmed. Four intruders. It is time to entertain our guests. Yes, it is. Sweet Caroline, Ben Ben, I've been inclined. All right, I've got point. You and Jin, that side. Move. Come on, tits. Well, what can you do? Ready. Ready, ready. Oh, Sub Zero. Swing, Caroline. Hmm. <laughs> I get to be sub zero. Damn it, Jin. Damn. You, I need to. You are not welcome here. State your intentions. Grandmaster, we need you to come with us. My name is Sergeant. Oh! You demand my cooperation, yet you are cut off, surrounded. What will you do? My father always spoke highly of you, Sub Zero. He wants to talk. Talking, always his first choice. Okay, let's try pummeling. Now! Wait! Oh! Ah! Whoa! Cassandra Cage, you lead this group, but they do not follow. What would your mother do? Stop wasting time and take you down. Really? What will I do? Fuck you up for saying that, bitch! What, you think I'm messing around? Oh, oh, oh! Oh, 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 you wanna hit me with that? Oh, I'll hit you with that! Oh, oh, I see why you want to play. I could play that game too, bitch. Oh, what did you just say to me? I'm less than what? Then what? Say what? Hey, stop fucking shooting me. <laughs> bitch. Let go. Come Are you gonna get cocky now? All right, you know what? I'll have to get out of that corner. I feel bad. That was hot. Do it again, bitch. Thank you. Cause it is good. Bruh, you look... <laughs> Bruh, I wasn't even going 100% on you. Ah! You are more like your mother than you think. Hmm. Takahashi Takeda. Oh. Where could I be? Behind you. 
dumb teenager. Your power should have revealed my intention, Takahashi Takeda. No doubt Kenshi taught you how to use them. My father taught me a lot, Grandmaster. Let us see. Not a lot, apparently. Sweet Caroline. Bitch. Fucking. Ah, you know how I don't like fire. Bruh. Just my patience. And life. Ah! Ah! Oh, wait, I'm going to. Ah, oh, fuck, I didn't. I'm a little too hard on him. You are not your father. Not yet. Huh? Oh! Damn it. No, you damn any now. Rival Jacqueline Briggs. Specialist Briggs. Yes. Military decorum is important in your family. If you know my father, you know me. Thought you and he were friends. Our history share a dark chapter. Just for saying that, I'm gonna fuck him up. Ow. Hey, you know my fire is my only weakness. Oh, I like fire too, don't worry. For special occasions. You know what I mean? Bruh. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> beep, 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 beep. Right behind you. That this is an Look at the nerd shit. Damn. Might cut it out with that, bro. Let me see some. Oh, that's how I do it. You've been fucked. Do not judge yourself harshly, Specialist Briggs. I'm picking my fucking gunshot wounds. Yeah. You still haven't had enough? Fuck them up. Kung Pao taught you, bitch. Perfect. Bravo. Kung Jin, you should rally your companions rather than mock your superiors. I'll remember that in case I ever meet one. Really? Are you cocky? I don't, you know how I feel about cocky people, right? Think they're better than that everybody, right? You know how I feel about that. Let me show you how I feel about that. That's no, that's not exactly how I feel about it, but let me show you.
This is how I feel about it. So don't be cocky. Bitch. False bravado does not suit you. Pretty nice combo, right? Wasn't the best, but pretty cool. Any ideas? Sub Zero, let's talk. That opportunity has passed. Got a new plan, Cage? You could have followed the old one, Jin. You're gonna catch hell if you kill us. Yes, I suppose so. Chuo, Tang Jin. That worked. That worked. This was all a, a... A training exercise. Damn, I should have seen it. You and your friends show much promise, Cassandra Cage. But until you function as one, you will fall short. He's talking to you, bow and arrow, dude. So other than that, you enjoyed your visit. The Lin Kuei shredded us. Yeah. You, maybe. I see plenty of frozen boot prints on your ass, too. Come on now. You're all winners in my book. New orders from General Blade. Priority one Outworlders. Here in Earthrealm. An invasion? Couldn't be. You're not afraid, are you, Mr. Cage? Outworlders, I can handle. <coughs> Ooh, growing the beard, aren't you, buddy? That's the new thing these days. So when did they show up? The portal opened by the docks a few hours ago. Nearly 5,000 in all. Refugees from the Outworld Civil War. Must be bad if they risk coming to Earthrealm. After you. Do not dwell on your encounter with the Lin Kuei, son. Pretty hard not to. Ah, freaks. Oh well. Hey, everyone's here. Thanks, Kenshi. Could you and Mr. Cage join us? Sergeant Cage, you and your team as you were. This is Li Mei. She seeks asylum for her people in Earthrealm. Our village, Sando, was the epicenter of a fierce battle. We barely escaped with our lives. Such is war. I don't really give a damn. I mean, no offense, but you outworlders kind of live for that, right? This was different. The rebels, Melina, had a weapon unlike anything. Entire battalions erased. It was not honorable, not combat. Tell me more about the weapon. A talisman, gold, with a center jewel. Melina wields its crimson energy without precision. Well, that's good then. Not now, Sergeant Cage. It is enough that she possesses it. It turns the tide in her favor. The Emperor grows desperate, and those caught in the middle pay the price. If this talisman is what I suspect it to be, we may all pay a price. We talking about Shinnok's amulet? Can't be. The base, the vault, your warnings. SF, Shaolin, no way anyone can get past all that. I must be certain. Well, this is cozy. Uh-oh. You remind me of an Earthrealmer who crossed over with us. He also found humor in everything. Handsome guy, right? He was an Earthrealmer. One of his eyes glowed red. What does she mean? Kenshi, continue with Li Mei. I'm going to the refugee camp. Gotta get to him before he finds a way out. I'll come with. Go get an update on camp security from Colonel Flag. Why? Because then you won't be here. Are we no. with you? What a bitch. No. 
I need to confirm with Kotal Khan that Li Mei's story is true. You and your team are going to Outworld. I don't know. I expected the sky to be purple or something. Don't believe everything you see online. And what makes you an expert? The Shaolin Archives. I studied a lot about Outworld. No substitute for experience. So what makes you our leader? Guys, let's stick to the mission. Li Mei has to be telling the truth. An invasion would violate the Reiko Accords. Because you can always trust an Outworlder. But if Outworlds are ally, why didn't they help us during the Netherrealm War? Against Quan Chi and his team of... Revenants? Like Jackie's dad? Asshole. Oh my god. It's not an alliance, not an aggression pact. Outworld is not our ally. A point you might make with more subtlety, given your surroundings. Now state your business, including a reason why we shouldn't kill you. I can read you. You're not from Outworld. I'm from Earthrealm, like you. But my employer, Kotal Khan, is from Outworld. So now I'm from Outworld. What? State your business. We're emissaries. We need to talk to Kotal Khan. Here, we have Raiden's official seal. I can buy one of those at that stall right over there. Look, you can arrest us, even kill us. But if we're telling the truth, you probably get a pay cut. Or worse. You take us to the Khan, I'll tell him you took us down. Maybe you get a bonus. You can't lose. Follow me. In these times of war, we are required to view every resource as a weapon for our emperor to use at his discretion. To take without his leave is to steal from the hand of Kotal Khan himself. Therefore, having been found guilty of theft, you shall be put to death. I was what? Hungry. Your sentence I was hungry. Immediately. Oh, he yeah. was hungry. Remember where you are. Jin. Bye bye. Oh. Aaron Jack. I knew I shouldn't have listened to you. A lesson in trust from a mercenary. Here's another learning opportunity. Oh. I forgot I completely how to play with this guy. I remember how to throw his arrow though. Oh, that's not an arrow. Wait, it's like this. Yeah, like that. Man, I know how to get shot in the face. It's an offense, retard. Why the air? Come here, come here. Come here. I hate to see your dry Oh, damn. Boom, bitch! Quick learner. There I am. 
Here comes Bicho Tazo. Shut the fuck up. Play, Tor. You couldn't just ask for a pony like every other girl? The archives never mentioned symbiotes. Like this thing. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Get him. Get him. Bichotazo! Uh oh, here comes Cassie. What dumb shit she gonna say? You here make trouble, Skinny? Trouble make you! Alright. I could work with that. Bichota! Oh! Oh, Bichotazo! Fucking bitch, stop throwing her at me! Oh, bitch. My God. Oh, fuck you, Tor. Stay lay down, boy. I could do that too. Just better than you, of course. Man, you a, you is a bitch. Oh my god! She just fucking bitch. You was a bitch, you know that? <sighs> Fuck, suck with this Kunjin. Uh, Jin Bin. Kunjin. Kunjin or Jin Kun Kun What's his name? Kung Jin. Hey, you threw her. Look at her. Look at her running around. Look at her. Look at her dumb ass running around. That didn't even hurt a little bit. Oh, damn. Fly. It hurts, doesn't it? Candela. Oh, damn. Don't kill me. Love to learn more about you. Too bad you're insane. Yeah. You guys all right? <laughs> oh God. <laughs> the poor. Uh. The Plora. This one must learn more of your diplomatic techniques. Yes, the Plora. I'm here to see Kotal Khan. General Blade. You interfere with outworld matters. The penalty is death. Hmm. Is so everything? Is everything death? Accords, we will consult the Emperor. You will await him here. Okay, Biatch. Opportunity to tell us what the fuck shit you were thinking? I gotta wonder why you'd risk interrealm war for a bread thief. 
Because not all thieves are irredeemable. Huh? We don't give a damn about all these people, except those two. Lu Chan and Kung Pao. Dragon. This is a dragon. Dog looking dragon. Stealing. Question is, who is he stealing from? It has more sentimental than monetary value. Hmm. Nevertheless, I would prefer you did not steal it. It's a family heirloom, one that shouldn't have been given to you. Your family honored me with this memento of your cousin Lao, after his death. A death you caused! You made him fight Shao Kahn! And stood there while that bastard snapped his neck! You go too far, Kung Jin. No, not far enough. There go. <laughs> I love that move. Radine, Radine, I'm sorry, Radine. Radina. Yeah, Radina. Come at me, Radine. Damn it, Radina. Catch me on my dirt, bitch. Now we even. And now we not. Descendant of the great Kung Lao, a common thief. Did you think you could walk unimpeded into my temple and walk out again without my complicity? You wanted me to attack you. Why? To release your anger, make you amenable to reason. Make me feel like shit. Self-loathing has always been an unfortunate part of your makeup. There lies ahead a brighter path, one that will truly honor your ancestors, one that is worthy of you. Go to the Wuxi Academy, join the Shaolin, like Kung Lao before you. I can't. They won't accept. They care only about what is in your heart, not whom your heart desires. It's too late for me. It is never too late, Kung Jin. Never. Your news of refugees is troubling. Their exodus to Earthrealm was not known to me. I do know this. 
I invited no guests from Earthrealm. Certainly none who would disrupt the execution of justice. How do I know you are not allied with Melina? Perhaps her newfound power has earned her new friends. Friends? No. No, we're not even sure that Shinnok's amulet she has. She employs Shinnok's amulet against me? The very item Earthrealm swore would be safe in its care? When Outworld was offered no participation? We were under attack, not Outworld. Odal Khan, the fire that burns the sun. We are here because we share your concerns about the missing item. We intend no ill against your rule. At least one Earthrealmer can forge words like silver. But I recall an Earthrealm expression. There is more honor among thieves than diplomats. I've had the questionable fortune to be both Emperor, but I'm telling you the truth. You are allied with Melina. You may carry out your sentence. Kotal Khan, under outworld law, I claim the right of defense by combat. What? You're gonna fight a duel? To absolve us of all accusations. Denying the request brings dishonor upon the accuser. You know much of Outworld. No, also, the duel ends in death. You have won nothing. Merely a few more seconds of breath. <laughs> Let's see about that. Oh, 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 oh! Oh my god! <laughs> but this guy is not taking it easy on me. Oh, oh! Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh! But chill! Oh my god, look at my health and look at his! Alright, so I'm giving it everything I got. Damn. This is not my round. No, it's not. It's his. Yeah. This one? Oh, it's mine. Damn, damn. Damn. Damn, locked it. Shit. Well, I guess I'm dead now. Just kidding. I'm giving it everything now. Now, nah, maybe I'm just I'm putting all my hard work. Everything. I'm giving it everything now. My fucking mutton bashing skills. Everything. Even my skill, bruh. Patience also. Fuck. So there goes patience. Boom. Told you. Watch this. Boom, bitch. Never put me in a corner. You don't impress me. I am the best in corners, bruh. Telling you, don't fuck with me. <laughs> Literally, everybody gets the best of me in the corner, now, but Emperor? not this time. The charges against you are void. I say to all that Earth Realm means outworld no harm. Now kill me. 
Be done with it. You're not actually gonna... Instead of your life, I claim your service. If Melina does have the amulet, we can get it from her more easily if we work together. Emperor, they cannot be trusted. Thora, can you not perceive? I am indebted to them. You honor us, Kotal Khan. Our gratitude is wide like the ocean. I'll talk to General Blade. Tell her about our new... arrangement. Thanks for the heads up, Sergeant. Stay with Kotal Khan. We'll figure out next... Tell you, Blade!